All right, guys, so in the fall, what I like to do is spoon feed my grass, and it helps it to thicken up and heal from the rough summer. And the way I do it is with the Wiz. I have mine set to four. You might need to adjust it based on your walking speed or the size of your uh, urea granules. But basically, I just go around once a week after I mow, use this, spread some fertilizer real quick, and then I water the lawn. And I'll do this weekly um, until the grass starts to slow down. Then I cut it off. And then once the grass has stopped growing for about a week or so, then I'll put down my winterizer application. Um, now I've got Kentucky bluegrass, so this really responds very well to that um, already. I've done it one time about a week ago. I forgot to video it, but um, it's already doing much better than it was. And so I'm gonna keep doing that because all that damage from the chinch bugs needs to get repaired and I'm gonna try to get it to fill in as much as possible before winter time so that way come springtime it's ready to get going and we can you know have this as a distant memory so here we go let's find my bucket of urea quick uh, word of caution sometimes this gets stuck open so be prepared to have a contingency plan for uh, how you're gonna react when it gets stuck open spewing out urea you don't want to just dump it all over the yard and burn your lawn out that being said, this really isn't too difficult. So this is what I do. Oh boy. I usually do this in the garage. I want you to be able to see it. There you go. Another tip is, uh, I'll show you, but I lean it forward a little bit to make sure the urea will fall towards the impeller. Um, but you don't want it to do it straight down because then it's shooting it, it's not spraying it out. I'll see if I can hold this while doing it. That's how easy it is. And then I dump the rest back into the bucket and seal it up. Now this fertilizer, am I recording? Yes. This fertilizer, if it gets wet, it will get really messy and uh, not evaporate, but whatever the chemical name is for that. So you don't want it to get wet, um, but you're just putting a small amount down every week. Um, you can, measure it weigh it out that way i did that the first few times i did it um, you want to do half a pound of nitrogen um, per thousand square feet um, or less depending on how much you want to mow and all that stuff but you just want a little bit each time and urea is fast release so the grass will gobble it up and respond almost immediately it doesn't need to be watered in so if it's not going to rain you want to water it in um, I would say within 24 hours 
some urea you might be able to go longer but I like to just look at the weather if it's not going to uh, rain in the next 24 hours I water it in and that's all there is to it um, it really for at least for cool season lawns it really helps build it up for a good winter time and it thickens it up and um, yeah it's, I, I'm hoping I didn't start too late this year I've just been so crazy but uh, it usually gets nice and thick before um, winter time so there you go all right I appreciate you guys watching my videos if you liked it please give it a thumbs up uh, subscribe comment all that fun stuff it's what makes this uh, really enjoyable and fun making all these videos and uh, be sure to check out the ones below have a great day bye